Oh, that's one. Oh. Is that another one? What's up, people? Welcome back to the channel. And today's video, it's going to be a few days of fishing, not just one day of fishing. I got a few fish catches for you, you know, with different baits. I hope you guys enjoy it. Should be a good one. Now, before we get into the video, I got a sponsor. So let me tell you guys about my sponsor. My sponsor is Gamnam Barbershop. It is a Christian-owned barbershop. It is a Korean-owned barbershop. Me being half Korean, you know, I love supporting my culture and the businesses that are in that culture. It's a great barbershop. I've been going to go see one of the stylists ever since I was 13 years old. And they've always done me good. If you're in the Duluth area, you can go and see them at 3182 Steve Reynolds Boulevard, suit number 107, Duluth, Georgia, 30096. Their hours are Monday through Saturdays, 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. So definitely go check those guys out. When you walk in, all you gotta do is just mention me. You'll get a small little discount. So with that said, let's get on to today's video. All right, so we are on the water and I'm gonna kind of go the other direct, you know, on the other side. I like to mix it up a bit. Well, there's only so much I can do mixing it up because, you know, my house is over here and I gotta go that way to get to the main lake. So I'm gonna start on this side and then work our way back this way, which would be the shaded side, even though I feel like that's kind of counterproductive because I'd rather fish the shaded side and then fish the side that is going to be in the sun longer. I've got a few baits, I got my bag, so if I want to switch up, I can, but I have a feeling I'm going to stick with these baits. I'm going to start out with this Guggen Squad all-white spinner bait, just because it seems like it'll do good today. But we'll see. Water's still pretty dirty. Just waiting for it to clear up. That would, you know, be really awesome. Something was telling me to fish a chatterbait today, but I was like, no, I just fished the chatterbait in my last video. So I wanted to do something a little, little different. This is an Ozark bait <laughs> and I'm throwing it on an Ozark rod. So we'll see. They do spawn a lot over here because of the beach and the sand. Is that a fish? It is a fish. <laughs> I didn't know. I was like, what is it? Oh God, almost lost him. Oh my God. Well, you guys saw that. That was good. That was good. That's hilariously good. Couldn't grab him. I did kind of touch him, touch my legs. Does that count? You guys tell me if that count. <laughs> you guys let me know if that count. He was flopping. That was cool. Okay, it's a new day. And I switched one bait and I also switched the blade. I put a bigger blade on this bird blue. This is our go over here. Let's see if there's anything. Had one, no way. No freaking way. 
that pause this area. Oh, that's one. That's one. Oh my god, that was one. These hooks. I guess that is the thing with the Ozark trailer hooks. Is they suck. Wow. Oh, on the spinner blade, yes, dude, that felt so weird too. He, it didn't even feel like he bit it. it; just felt like I was hitting, hitting like a stump or something. But he's, it's just a pound. It's a pound fish. Just back, he's got that curl, that cold curl, really cold curl. He's curling hard. He's curling hard. But yeah, that's a fish. Awesome. Cool. Thanks for biting, dude. All right. So it's a, another, another day. <laughs> and guess what? It rained last night. So the water is just as dirty as it was before. Hasn't changed. But we're out here. We're out here early. But we're going to come out here. We're gonna see if we can catch one. I put a chatterbait on today just because, you know, I felt like chatterbait would work today. I got a, a black and blue mini max chatterbait on there with a hog farmer spunk shack hematoma color. Um, if you don't know about the hematoma color, it is mainly a black with a little bit of blue, but it's mainly black. And I got hung up. Thought it was a bite. Something right there. Dang, man. Also, while I'm thinking about it, my wife is in a contest for the cover of Ink Magazine. You know, I know you guys have seen my tattoos, so you know I'm really into, you know, the artwork. You know. And, you know, it was my job at one point to do tattoos, you know. So, if you could and you have the time, I'll leave a link in the description below. Go and vote for my wife so that she could be on the cover of Inked Magazine. You know, it would, it would definitely make her super happy. So, the voting just started, you know, on Monday. So, hopefully, you know, I know there's going to be like thousands of girls, you know, trying to win. But if you could help support my wife, that would be amazing. That's, that's one. Oh, yeah. That's one. Oh, God. That's a nice one. That is, he is nice. Nice, nice. Let me get that out of the top of his lip. Because, you know, that's where you want it to get hooked. But that guy is nice. He's fat. He is fat. We're weighing you. You're close to a three. You are close. That's cool. He's close three. All right. Let's see. Oh wow. Okay, he is. He is a three. Three pounds, two ounces. Nice. But there we go. Three pounder, right there. Cool. He's 
Nice. Thank you, dude. Thank you for biting. Oh, oh, and he's gone. Is that another one? It is. It is another one. Yes. Cool. That was on the bottom jaw. That's so crazy. That's, why'd you eat it like that? It's a one pounder right here. Oh, he's curling. <laughs> he won't let me hold him right. He's curling. He's starting to get some color back. That's really cool. Awesome. I guess I'll weigh him too so you guys can know that, hey, I'm kind of accurate with my, with my weights. Kind of. Figure it out. All right. Yeah, one pound nine ounces that's cool all right all right release thanks for biting dude yeah he's ready to go okay we are back and man what a great few days of fishing we got that one on the crankbait that flopped around that was really cool definitely gonna have to switch out those hooks on that ozark crankbait because it doesn't seem to actually get the fish so I'm gonna have to do that, switch out that hook. I was really happy to get that fish on the spinner bait, you know, after I changed the blade, the blade out, you know, for a bigger one and a brighter one. So that was really cool. And then catching that three pounder on that mini max chatterbait was really cool. And then that one pounder after it, that was, that was just a fun day, you know, like fun time fishing. It's always, it's always good to catch fish. And just a little reminder, if you could go vote for my wife on the cover, for the cover of Inked Magazine, you know, the, co the contest that's going on right now, it'd be super awesome if you guys could support her because without her, I would not be able to come out on the water as much as I do. You know, she takes care of stuff at the house while I'm here. If you could go support her, that would be awesome. I'll leave a link down in the description below you know, so you guys can go check that out. But yeah, that's the video, you guys. If you could, press that like button. Yeah, I don't, I don't really like, I don't know. I feel weird asking you guys to do that stuff. So, you know, it's a bit weird, but I definitely don't mind asking you guys to watch another video, you know, because, hey, that helps me out as well. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time.